Hey, what's going on guys? So today we're going to break down the quickest way to financial freedom. It's winning the lottery, obviously. Just kidding. But seriously, we're going to go over that right now. All right, so let's jump on in here. What I truly believe is the quickest way to financial freedom, again, in my opinion, is to line up some Airbnbs. All right, so what I'm gonna show you here is I'm gonna show you one, two, three, four, and five. So right now, we currently own five Airbnbs. Uh, one, two, and three are already set up and ready to go. Um, they're already creating income right now for us. And then four and five are under construction and four is almost finished and number five will be finished uh, probably in the next 60 days or so. So here we go. Number one, park. Number two is Franklin. Whoops. Number three, Smokey. Number four, Virginia. And number five, Washington. So number one, Park Ave here. So this property, uh, this property currently brings in 7,000 a month. Uh, Franklin currently brings in 6,000 per month. Smokey, 6,000 per month. We're guesstimating that Virginia is going to be 6,000 per month and that Washington will be 7,000. So this right here is going to be, is going to be the sales that it brings in. Park Ave, so again, uh, on all the properties, we're going to minus $1,000 on every property because that's what we pay out in cleanings. So as I've said before, cleanings are extremely important so you need to make sure you have great cleaners. If you don't have great cleaners, you're not gonna get good reviews. If you don't get good reviews, you're not gonna have people stay with you. So, cleanings. Um, okay, next we're gonna go with your mortgage payments, right? Um, so mortgage payments, um, and again, guys, I'm doing kind of round numbers because I don't have the exact numbers in front of me for like, you know, but I'm gonna get it down to, you know, very similar, like very close to what they actually are. Uh, Park Ave's mortgage payment is about 2,200. Franklin's is about 1,700. Smokey's is 1,200. Virginia's is going to be 1,200 as soon as we refi out. And Washington's will be about 1,700 as well. All right, so this is mortgages. Next, we've got utilities. All right, so on average, again, we got water, trash, electric, and internet, right? So those are the things that are gonna come out of this as well, because you're obviously not having your tenants, the Airbnb guests are not paying this. You're paying this. So you got 300, 300, 300 across the board. And so again, so what we've kind of seen is that's usually gonna be give or take around 50 bucks a month for water. Um, that's gonna be about 150 a month for electric. Um, and then that's gonna leave say, you know, 20, 30 bucks a month in trash and then about 70 bucks a month for internet. You better make sure you got good internet as well because when people are staying at Airbnbs, they wanna make sure that they can surf the web, they wanna make sure that they can stream, all that kind of stuff. So let's go ahead and break these numbers down now. Perfect. So we got 25, 35. So this is going to leave 3,500 here. We've got two, three. This leaves 3,000 a month here. This leaves 3,500. 3,500 a month here. Look at these numbers. 35, two, three. And this is gonna leave 
4,000 here. All right, so if we add these numbers up here, we're looking at 7, 11, 14, 17, 5. So guys, this leaves, I'm oh, gonna just delete this now. We're gonna erase this right here. That leaves $17,500 per month. And again, this already includes your cleanings right here, right? So again, if you are trying to get become, if you're trying to become financially free, I truly believe this is the fastest way to do it. If you can put numbers like that together with just five Airbnbs, if you could buy one property a year for five years, I know it's a, a big goal, but again, if you can kind of, you know, cut back on other things where you're spending money, and if you can figure out a way to make this work, that right there per month, you don't have to work another day in your life. Depending on the type of lifestyle that you want to live, that right there will take you a very, very long way and let you live a very happy life. So again, that's my quickest way to financial freedom. That is the way that we are going to continue growing is through Airbnbs. So hope you liked this video. If you did, be sure to give it a two thumbs up and also be sure to like and follow our page and make sure you're commenting below. Let me know what you thought about this. Let me know if you want to, you know, try to figure out how to buy some Airbnbs. We'll see if we can help you out later.